Hey guys, what's going on? It's Uncle Tone. How are you guys doing? Today we're going to have kind of a different video for you guys. I normally don't do application reviews. However, I came across this new launcher available in the Google Play Store. I believe it became available yesterday in the Google Play Store, but I could be wrong. Um, called Everything dot me and this is kind of a completely different launcher than I have seen on the uh, Google Play Store before I've tried a few of them I generally prefer Nova launcher but I have tried Apex launcher go launcher uh, buzz launcher I've tried a bunch of different launchers and this one is kind of completely different and unique to any other launcher that I've tried before I kind of wanted to share it with you guys so we're gonna go ahead and take a quick look at it cool beans so here we have the main screen of the everything.me launcher. Basically in this one um, it's fairly simple. Uh, those of you who really like to customize the look and feel of your Android phone probably won't really be into this one. Basically what this one is is a dynamic launcher that kind of changes based on how you use your phone. Um, it's really kind of neat and kind of different. Here along the top we have the everything bar. I don't know if that's what they call it but that's what I'm going to call it. I'm going to call it the everything bar. Uh, and you can use that to search. And then here along the bar, along underneath that, we have what they call the smart folders. Uh, and these basically organize all of your apps into certain folders. Uh, another cool thing about these smart folders is the wallpaper changes uh, based on what you're looking at, which is kind of cool. It has kind of unique and, and cool changing wallpapers and stuff. So I open up the social folder. And here in the social folder, you can see I have all of these social media apps that I have installed on my phone here along the top. And then you have a little line across here. And then underneath, you have other social media for, you know, applications that you might be interested in. And if you wanted to download one of them, say, I already have LinkedIn, uh, maybe Pinterest. Say you want to download and install Pinterest, you can simply tap on it. And that'll open up kind of a uh, web app. And then you can simply tap download. And it will take you directly to the Google Play Store where you can download it. Uh, which is kind of cool and different. Uh, really kind of neat. I mean, kind of a neat way to get app suggestions for apps that you don't have but you might be interested in based on your other interests. So that's the social folder. Uh, let's go over here take a look at the games folder. Here are all the games I have installed on my phone. And again, you can see the wallpaper changes dynamically to a game controller, which is kind of cool. So there's the games I have installed and below that you can see suggestions for some other games that I may be interested in as well. Kind of cool. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at movies. I watch a lot of movies. So, you know, I'm, I'm definitely really interested in movies. I like this dynamic with changing wallpaper too with this older fella sitting here going, whoa, good. And he's watching a 3D movie in IMAX or something. Kind of cool. I like that. So there are the movie you know, apps and video apps that I have installed on my phone and below that there are more suggestions for other apps that you might find useful. Really neat kind of smart folders for your apps which are kind of cool. Uh, taking a look at the everything bar. Now what's what this can be used is to search for apps that may be on your phone or may not be on your phone. For example I just finished playing the new Tomb Raider game which I love. I'm a huge Tomb Raider junkie so say I wanted to do a quick search for Tomb Raider, all I have to do is tap the voice thing here and say Tomb Raider. Tomb Raider. And it will automatically do a search for Tomb Raider and load a Laura Croft wallpaper, which is kind of cool. So here are some apps I might be interested in based on my search, you know, GameSpot and IGN and, and stuff like that, kind of cool. So there you go, maybe you're into sports. And you want to see the latest sports scores. Uh, you want to look for you know, like a sports score app or something. All you have to simply do is tap the voice thing. Sports scores. And there we'll search for sports score apps that you can you know download and install onto your phone to get all the latest sports updates on your phone. Kind of unique. Kind of cool and kind of different. You can access the settings menu simply by tapping and holding on the screen to add apps or add more smart folders or add any of the widgets that may be on your phone to the main screen if you like. These are all the widgets I have installed on my phone and I can add any of those to the home screen just as I would like. Uh, to access settings and stuff, I'm still uh, 
can you access all that through the notification panel here there's settings right there take you straight into your settings or you can access settings by simply tapping on here and going to settings which is kind of cool uh, so it is rather limited and it is still in beta right now I imagine you'll see a few more features and, and stuff added in updates right now but it is available for free on the Google Play Store if you guys so if you guys want to check it out I'll put a link to it right down there in the bottom bar where you can check it out on the Google Play Store and that's pretty much going to do it for the everything.me launcher guys uh, really kind of cool and kind of different dynamic launcher that I haven't seen before um, I don't think it's been done before actually which is kind of cool if you like to customize the look and feel of your Android phone a lot this is probably isn't going to be for you this is really fairly simple kind of a simple more basic kind of a launcher uh, but if that's your kind of thing you might really be into this so head over to the Google Play Store and check it out thanks a lot for watching don't forget to smash the like button down there go ahead and subscribe if you're not already and I'll see you guys in the next video Cool beans. Rock on.